are you? So do you. You sounded amazing Thank out you. there. How was it to sing with JD and just to be out there? I really was hoping he'd say yes because I've never really sang it with a boy yeah. like that. And I was so proud of him. Yeah. It was emotional. Was it really? Mm -hmm. Every time you sing a Wicked song, I imagine some sort of emotion comes flooding up. Is that true? Yeah, October. This October, 16 years. And I was only 16 when we did it, so wow. <laughs> it's just crazy to me that yeah. it's been going on that long, and people still love it, you know? People do I'm, still love it. I'm proud it. of that. You know, the movie's coming out 2021. I know. I'm like, who's going to be in it? Ariana Grande and Dove Cameron. They better be. It's funny you say that, because <laughs> Dove told me that she would be so honored and that you are such a legend and an icon. She had nothing but nice things to say. Why do you think she would be the perfect Glinda? The role of Glinda requires a wide vocal range. She's got that. It is the big, a big arc in the show. It's, she starts out Glenda the Bad and becomes, it's what makes her good, you see that. And she's got the acting chops to do it. And you know, I, she's my baby. If I had had a child, it would be dumb. Yeah, well, you guys look so much alike too, it's crazy. I mean, I played her mother twice and there's a reason and I just see great things for her. I see great things for you because you have a new album coming out for the girls. Yes. Ms. Dolly Parton on the album. How'd you get that? just asked. I never thought she'd say yes. You just call her up? <laughs> kind of. And she was like, yeah, send me, send me what you think. And I was thinking of wanting to do Here You Come Again. That's not Here You Come Again. She goes, why don't we do a song I wrote? And then she gave us I Will Always Love You, which I can't believe. We, That's my, you know, my queen. The... I know. Thank you. I, I listened to it today again, and I was like, I'm emotional right now. Thank you. I wanted to just celebrate her. She's been such a big influence on my life. You can tell on this record who is. You know, you can just see it. Well, Ariana also <laughs> on the record. My yeah. other baby. Your other baby. Mm -hmm. What was it like to work with her in this capacity? I knew I wanted to do, I've always told her she should re, uh, visit Leslie Gore and maybe play her life story, so I'm just putting it out there. Um, I knew You Don't Own Me seemed like us. Um, I don't like to refer my, to myself as old school, but I do think this song is old school versus new school because it's orchestrated, uh -huh. and then I added electric guitar. I wanted to celebrate Leslie Gore, and I thought, who could I do this with that's, you know, got that kind of voice, and it's Ariana. Well, I can't wait to hear what that song uh, sounds like. Are you guys friends now? Like, are you texting with Ariana Grande? Yes. Yes? Okay, what do you text with Ariana well, about? If I tell, then it won't be <laughs> special. I just love her. I'm proud of her. I've known her since she was a little kid. Her grandma brought her to see Wicked, and she said, I want to be a singer, too. And I thought, oh, well, that's sweet. Yeah. <laughs> and I gave her a wand. I said, you'll do it. And You gave her a wand? I gave her a wand, and she kept it. She kept it all this, what? all these years. Yeah. Where does she have this one? I don't know. I think it's at her mom's house. Isn't that nuts? That is so special. I'm, I'm so honored. Yeah. I, I love just, her. I feel like you guys need to work together again in some capacity, doing something. Do you guys talk about that? Like, what could we do? Like, maybe on screen? Yeah. I, I really, really want a, a shepherd, a project for her. I think it's important for people in who've lived as like I have to shepherd our young. I do see her playing Leslie Gore. I'm just saying it. Um, she's got the voice and that actress and singer went through a lot and Ariana has the acting chops as well. So you can see what I'm doing here. I want these girls to fly. You want them to fly? You yes. want them to soar. Yeah, this is why this album is important for the girls, you know. I was going to say, what does this album, I mean, you've put out so much music and your voice just gets more and more angelic, but what does this really mean to you? It's just really, you know, I think about all the songs I've wanted to sing and it, I looked at the list and it's all my favorite singers. And um, some didn't make the cut, which is hard, you know, but we're having a renaissance, women. Yes. We're having a resurgence. And I want it to be for the girls, but I also want to say, hey, Dad, you know, this is for the men who loved us, too, because my dad was a great, is a great influence on my life. So, you know, it, I wouldn't be where I am without him, without him saying, you can do it, you can do it. So, yeah, it's for the girls, but it's, it's for the guys who love us, too. Yeah, I love that. I also got to ask about uh, a little Hallmark movie coming out with Scott Wolf. I am obsessed with all things Hallmark. I was actually at the TCAs and I saw you perform. Oh, I was there. I love Hallmark. You also sound amazing that night. Um, what was it like working with Scott? Well, I was the first day I was just staring at him and maybe drooled. And I said, after I get over my drooling situation, I'll get over it. And he's like, I have to put my pants on just like you, Casey. And we just became... Very close. Yeah. I just love him. He's such a good family guy, and he loves his work. He's professional and fun. My kind of guy. And uh, I hope there's more for us. I think there will be. You think we're going to get a sequel? I hope so. Yeah. When does it come out? It comes out? It comes out um, around th uh, Thanksgiving. Okay. And uh, I also wrote uh, the title song for it with my friend Shelly Wright. So it's 
it's when I, it's called When Angels Land, and I can't wait for people to hear it. So we're gonna get some new music in that movie. Yeah. So much new, Kristen. I'm so excited about it. You've done so much. You've done TV. You've done movies. You've done Broadway. Is there anything else on your bucket list that you would love to accomplish? Produce. Produce. Yes. They're the guys that get all the money. <laughs> and now women. <laughs> so we got to produce a project with Dove and, and Ariana. Maybe, yeah. I think so. I think that's, I think you just nailed it. You heard it here first, ladies.